Okay, so I've just finished filming a live stream over here in Camp Pickafore. You can see I'm still down here. I shall link to that live stream right at the end of this video. But this is a warning to anyone coming over here to Mallorca this week. Now, before I give you the weather forecast, which obviously this video is about, I do want to issue a warning, and that is going to be about hiring a car in Mallorca for the week ahead. We have a lot of cycle holidays over here on the island at the moment. It is cycle season here in Mallorca. So my main message here is to have some patience if you're driving around the island. Allow more time for your journey too because, well, I've seen some really quite horrific overtaking here of groups of cyclists on the roads. It's been quite scary and um, I don't want to hear of any accidents with cyclists on the roads over here in Mallorca this week. Sorry, I'm just going to have to put my sunglasses on. It's so bright over here still. Anyway, um, please be patient. Leave extra time for your journey. Just be careful of the cyclists and just take overtake safety as well. Just do not take any risks. Now, on the other hand as well, I would like to say too, if you're over here cycling this week, please can you also have some respect for people that live here on the island? Yes, many of us many of us many of our livelihoods here on the island are made up from tourism and we depend on tourism as well to be able to live and exist on the island but on the same token please please if you're traveling along mountain roads if you're coming through towns and villages every few kilometers we would absolutely love it if you just pulled in and that the huge train of traffic just come by you and um, it will help us go about our business because don't forget people may be going to hospital appointments they may be going to doctor's appointments they may have work and business appointments or they may just be going to work or trying to pick up their kids from school so please be respectful if you're coming over um, but please respect from both sides would be very much appreciated as we go on into the summer now i just wanted to give out that message um, but we're going to head on now down towards alcudi beach and let's find out what the weather forecast is like for the week ahead so what better place to give my weekly weather update than over here on Alcudia Beach and you can see how absolutely gorgeous it is today. Now I'm filming this on the Sunday but this weather update is for the week ahead from April the 15th onwards. Now as you can see we're enjoying, enjoying really lovely temperatures here of around 25 degrees Celsius. It really feels like summer over here but just bear in mind as well that we haven't hit proper summer and the weather is a little bit up and down at the moment but as we head on into next week well we are going to be still seeing these lovely warm temperatures for the first part of the week until they dip down slightly midweek to around 17 or 18 degrees celsius but don't worry too much what you're seeing on the weather at the moment. If you see clouds on the on your weather app, it might not actually be that cloudy. We might get plenty of sunshine too, but also it might be a lot warmer too. So trust me, in the shade, it might actually be a lot warmer than the temperatures say they are too, particularly if that sun comes out. Now we're gonna head now towards the pier. We're gonna head on towards the jetty. We're gonna have a few views over Alcudia Beach, and I'll give you an update about the evening temperatures too, and then what the weather's going to be like as we head on into next weekend. Now we can see the sunbeds are already out over here on Alcudia Beach. Unlike the southwest of the island, unfortunately, you can just see how busy it is down here. We've obviously got a lot of residents down here this Sunday. It's looking absolutely gorgeous. I can see how clear the water is too. Got lots of people in swimming today. If you're wondering whether you can swim, if you're coming over this week, then well, of course you can. I'm still getting asked that question over on the Facebook group and in comments as well, but you can see there are plenty of people in the sea today. So even though we're having a little bit of a dip in the temperatures midweek, don't worry too much. Those temperatures are going to be warming up in time again for next weekend, which is absolutely perfect. If you're coming over for a short break, if you're coming over for a weekend break, those temperatures should be up at around towards the 20 degrees Celsius mark. But what about the evenings? Well, the temperatures are going to be cooling off in the evenings as we head towards the midweek as well. They're already quite cool actually during the evenings at the moment. We're getting loads of around 14 degrees celsius at night 
that's going to drop down towards around nine degrees Celsius. So if you are coming over, if you're going out for dinner, just make sure you, you bring a jumper, you bring a jacket, you bring some long trousers too, because it is very chilly going out on the evening. Now we're just gonna have a quick look down Alcudia Beach today. It's looking absolutely gorgeous. Now I'm very pleased to say as well that the winds that we did have during the week have now eased off. But with that, we've had problems, as you may well have seen on the channel, with jellyfish. So it's not uncommon to get jellyfish over here in Mallorca during the spring. And well, this spring has been no exception either. You may have seen my video from the other day about jellyfish down in Parmanova. I'm happy to say I went walking down in Pagera this morning and we actually went walking through the, the sea in Pagera and I didn't see any jellyfish down there. Hopefully in Parmanova as well, those jellyfish are going to be clearing away soon. But if you are swimming in the sea, and of course the sea is perfectly swimmable, just keep an eye out for them because because, well, well, they can pop up at any point on beaches all over the island. So with this amazing weather, we're not just seeing tourists on the beach this weekend, we're seeing a lot of residents too. The beaches are absolutely packed. You can see the sunbeds are out. Don't forget as well with the Alcudia sunbeds, you can actually book them online too. I'll drop a link below to that. Let's just quickly head on down briefly down the back of the beach. Okay, so what else is going on on the island this week? Well, the biggest news, of course, is that I'm going to be filming all week with Lee from the, who is the Mac Master. Check out the Mac Master YouTube channel. I shall drop his link below this video. I'm gonna be doing a very different series of videos this week. We're gonna have a, someone else's perspective about visiting many of the places in Mallorca for the very first time. So it's gonna be great to see what he thinks of the island as well. He is YouTube royalty in terms of travel vlogging too. The, the videos are going to be entertaining, so make sure you check those out. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already and do the same to his channel as well. Support his videos too. But while I'm down here, let's just take one quick look down the back of the beach. We're going to be back here in Alcudia to film during the week. But of course, you're going to want to have a quick look at what is going on to the beachside Chiringuitos as well. Now, I literally cannot believe it because I'm right up out in front of the Ibero Star Ciudad Blanca Hotel. And even the, the beach bar, the Chiringuito that they'd renovated over the past year or so, that has also been taken off the beach. You may remember my video, which I filmed um, about a month ago go showing the start of the demolition of the beach bars down here and they really have come along the beach here to take every single last one out they have been fenced off i can't see them causing too much problems to visitors over here in alcudia you can see how fast the beach is as well and you can see how far people are away from any of these little miniature building sites but hopefully these new beach bars will be built built soon and they'll be up and running soon too but not for the immediate future as well we can see here okay everyone it's going to be a fantastic week ahead not only on my channel as well but also on the mac masters channel it's going to be an amazing week weather wise over here in mallorca temperatures are around eight or nine degrees above what they should be it's great for people coming over hoping to enjoy an early summer break so if you are coming over travel safe don't forget your sunscreen as well bring your sun hat bring a whole mix of clothes too i can't see any rain on the horizon but who knows that could change as we go on through the week but I don't think we're going to be seeing any rain in the next seven days. Okay, everyone, I'll be back next week with another quick weather update for the week ahead. I hope you find this video useful. And don't forget, you can find me on Facebook and my Instagram, also called Mallorca Under the Sun. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Goodbye for now.